This is a short demonstration to use Quicken in success stores. Click on the icon Quicken and it'll open up into your registry for all your pre-authorized campers that the parents have given them amounts to spend. Once the camper comes to you and purchases the item, note it down on a piece of paper, then later on find the name, click on the name, Once you find the camper's name, open up their folder. You would click on Form, and that'll bring you into the pre-existing invoice. Then you go to Next, and you find the item that the camper purchased. Tab over, and click Save, and Done. You can do this as many times as you need to. If you need to delete the item, you would just go to Form again go to the item, click on edit, and delete the item, and then close or save the invoice. To add a new camper, the parent will send in the information for pre-authorized amount, click on invoice, type in camper's last name, then first name, You should receive the paperwork from the Oceanside campus and let you know how much it's been pre-approved for. You want to put in the camp code, click yes, yes. Then you want to put in the GPS code, which is their accounting code, which should be on the paperwork you receive from the Oceanside office. Once that's done, go down, press D for deposit, tab over, put in the amount the parent has authorized, Please be sure to put a negative, minus, and then the number. When you're finished, click Save and Done, and the camper will be added to the program. For cash, credit, and check sales, go to a pre-made invoice labeled Camp Day 1 or Day 2 or Day 3, depending on which day you're on. Add the item that the camper purchased. You can add as many items as you'd like. It can be more than one camper. Collect the money. When you're finished with collecting the money, click OK. Then you want to print the invoice. Once you print the invoice, look at the total amount at the bottom of the invoice, and that is how much cash you should have. Once that is completed, take the invoice and the cash wrap it in an envelope and file it for day one. You would continue a new invoice for camp day two and so forth. This will all go back to the Oceanside office. When you first arrive to camp, you will need to print a registry of all the pre-authorized campers and the amounts that their parents have given them for the success store. You would go to reports and then click on print and that'll print you out all the names and the amount that each student, each camper gets. Once that is done, you will need to create the store cards that you give to the campers and they will hand you their store cards so you know what credit they have to purchase items in the store.